Let's see how this plays out. Oh, you want the receipt for this thing? Just say no receipt. What's up? Am I free to go with the TV? Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. What are you? I just told you. Hey, stop. What are you doing? Right. You're under arrest right now. All right. Because you won't identify yourself. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's see what would happen if that kid was a lawyer. Come on, it's just a prank, bro. Give me that. I'm not under arrest, so you can't take my phone. Yeah, well, you can't film in Walmart. It's private property and it's their policy. I've told you this before. Okay, fine. I'll put the phone away. All right, let me see some ID. No. What? But I said, doesn't matter, I haven't committed a crime. You're being annoying to the Walmart employees. Being annoying isn't a crime. Look, your prank involves you walking out of the store with a TV and no receipt. Yeah. In several states, 27 to be exact, all I have to have is reasonable suspicion you're committing a crime. Uh-huh. Then asking for your ID is a lawful order, and if you don't comply, I will arrest you. Right, but the problem is, here's my receipt, I paid for it, we're talking cash. I didn't commit a crime, that would be an unlawful arrest, and then the prank would turn into getting an officer fired. 